I'm Debbie Shepard and I am the head volleyball coach at Chalice High School. I have been coaching here for 25 years. I've been head coach for nearly 20. We've had three state championships. We've had Warren here for probably close to 10 years helping um, our teams to succeed. Chalice, Idaho is a small community in central Idaho. There's about a thousand people in our town. We have probably next year 90 kids in our high school. This year we were close to 100. My name is Carly, I'm from Charles, Idaho, and I'm at the volleyball clinic, and I pole vault. Pole vaulting in Charles, Idaho? Of course! The purpose of this drill is to just get you unstuck out of the box that you're currently in. You are allowed to do whatever you got to do to keep that ball alive. If you're rolling around on the ground, that's great. If you're using your foot, that's great. If you use your elbow, that's great. Do what you got to do to keep the ball in the F-15 around. Two, come on! It's not just about being competitive with the team that we're playing against, it's also about being competitive with the people that you're with. Because if I want to win and you want to win and we're both outside hitters, I want to take your spot. Is that fair? So it's okay that we're competing for the same thing. So you're competing with friends, you're competing with companions, you're competing with anybody who's on the other side of the net. So get a ball, get a partner, we're going to start again. Go! Okay, last round. Oh, another fight. All right, all right, we'll call that a draw. Okay. We fight for every ball. We get bruises, right? We get hurt, and then we keep fighting. We keep fighting, that's how we get better. All right, sound good? All right. Volleyball is also a very athletic game. So let me see how athletic we are. Shall I go? Face it. Got it? Lovely. Swing it down. Yes, good. Oh, let's go, let's go, let's go, 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 The kids who have this are the kids who get better fast. Right? Because their brains are moving fast. They're more confident. If they, if they act with urgency and they trust their first instinct and they make a mistake, they hurry up and move on to the next point. First one, which is the first thing you do in the game, which is a serve. Okay? First thing we're going to do is we're just going to address the ball. So I'm standing like I'm on a snowboard, heading in that direction. You guys with me? I'm not standing like this. Watch the ball. Watch the ball. Throw step in. But we also have to learn to dig the ball above our shoulders, which means we have to start learning this skill set. This way. The purpose of this drill is to just get you unstuck out of the box that you're currently in. You are allowed to do whatever you've got to do to keep that ball alive. If you're rolling around on the ground, that's great. If you're using your foot, that's great. If you use your elbow, that's great. Do what you've got to do to keep the ball in the F-15 around. Two, come on! Three, four, five, six, come on! Seven, 
This game is called Doghouse. If you win, you move out of the doghouse. Nice ball. hours of volleyball. It didn't feel like it went fast, right? That's because of you guys. Thank you for working hard. Thank you for having such a great attitude. Thank you for all getting along. I think it's fantastic that kids from other schools can come here and everybody kind of feels comfortable. Here's my takeaway from this club, or from this game. You surprised me. It wasn't until we started playing that six on six game for three in a row that I saw your personality come out. And your personality is different than I thought it was. Because remember I mentioned that most of you are extroverts on the bench, excuse me, introverts, right? Individually, you guys are kind of quiet. But for something happened when you all stepped on the court together, something happened and I started to feel an energy. Did you guys feel that as well? When you're playing so that you can feel the energy, that means you know you're doing well. Be great on three. One, two, three, three, three. Bye, bye.